All right, you guys, so check out how to create some animated product presentation mockups here in Firefly. This is great because now you can do quick video mockups for clients if you're a 3D artist, and from there the client can choose a direction and then you can create it in 3D version in softwares. And I'm gonna work with this PSD mockup as a reference, and I'm also gonna go and change up the text on it. And I'm gonna replace it with this. It's totally not cosmetic related, but I just wanna show you how the AI is going to make it consistent on the product. And from here, I'm gonna go to Firefly. Let's change up the image to video. Click on generate. And here we can change up the resolution, but I'm gonna go with 540. And let's go down here to the frame and click on the first frame. And here I'm gonna go and select the mockup with the logo that I made. Click on open. And all you have to do is go to the prompts and just dress up the mockup. For example, I'm gonna type in palm leaves growing behind the product and click on generate. All right, so let's see what we got. Click on play and check this out. The logo is like 90% intact. Now it's still gonna get distorted a little bit. And also take that in mind that these prompts won't generate the same thing all the time. For example, now I generated a totally different idea with the same prompts. I also gonna add stay still, let's hit play. <laughs> now that is weird. All right, so let's try something else. I'm gonna go to the prompt and delete. I'm gonna type in white orchids growing around the products, surrounding it with white petals. All right, so let's see. And nice. Again, now it's spinning for some reason and the plants are not even growing. So I'm gonna go and select the static. Let's see what happens. Hit play. And finally, all right, so this way worked but now they are not growing from the product. Somebody is throwing the flowers. I think the AI is misunderstanding something. All right, so after a bunch of generations, I finally found some solutions. Don't try this at home. And finally, I ended up with white orchid plants growing around and behind the product. All right, so let's take a look. And it's not what I wanted, but it's what the AI wants. Now, but at least I'm gonna try out the last prompt and this is gonna be white orchids growing and surrounding the product. The cap of the product is floating in the air, revealing the white glowing cream inside. And let's hope for the best. Oh, wow. So this eventually worked out, but the plants are basically coming from the top to the bottom or something like that. And the logos are still intact, which is good. I'm gonna try one more thing with this. I'm gonna uncheck the static and try out this way. Let me see if it's gonna create the same. Um. Okay, that's really interesting. <laughs> and now I'm gonna try it out with zoom in and generate. Oh shit, I just used up all the generations. The fun is over now, guys. This was it. I don't know if I'm gonna purchase this again, but anyways, thanks for watching and see you on the next one.